Okay, so this won't be too long, I guess. But, uh, so I've been testing this 960 in this system. Yeah, I did go ahead and I put the i5 20, uh, i5 12400 into the Case Air case. I wasn't going to do that. This is Saturday. So Friday, I was supposed to receive a new case. I was going to go ahead and put it in a new case. But UPS is the one delivering it. A person delivering it, we looked on the cameras, didn't even bring the box. They just brought a, a, the sticker notifying you that they made an attempt and they just stuck a sticker on the door and ran, ran off. When the office was open, all they had to do was tap on the window to get their attention or do the little buzzer thing. But I'm not going to get into that. But I was supposed to have been yesterday. I was gonna, it's a white case with two RGB fans in the front. So I was going to go ahead and put this system in it. For now, I'm running this 850 watt from, you know, the power supply from the other computer. So it's a thermal take 850 watt power supply, you know. But right now I have the 960 2 gig model in here testing it. It's been running perfectly fine. But I went ahead and you can, you know, probably not see. But, you know, here's the, here's the box, you know, from eBay. So went ahead and got this you know can you see it pretty good this uh rtx 2080 and you know, i got this for a good price it isn't that far off from like a 3060 ti at least in my benchmarks and this is a a, a decent card i paid this is why i'm doing the video i paid like 190 for this card i think i got a really good deal 190 if i go on there and try to buy one right now I could get a really not so desirable one for like fifty dollars more. So yeah, I think it's a really good dot. I'm gonna pop this in here. Hopefully the drivers are the same. So I can just pop this card in here and be ready to go, right? Because this is a you know it's got the newest drivers on it, so you just unhook this. I don't know what the hell's going on out in the hallway, but it seems like they're making a lot of noise out there. Yeah, it's like a big network now. Homeless people keep getting in the building. Uh, it, it, you know, they get like one in here and then they call each other. Like they have a network to, to and then one of them will let their, you know, let other people in. Yeah, because of this cooler as big as it is and the and this uh thing being up as high as it is, I have to use let's unhook this cable. I have to use this rod this to help me get the card out because there's no room for your fingers to get in there because this cooler is way too big. So you can see here is the this come from the other system. I just recently did a video on. So I put this cover on myself. Protect that. Let's pop this in. Yeah, I hate that to try to get this out. And this is going to be even worse because it has a back plate on it. So just sit this in here. So this video is just showing this card. I received it. And, you know, see if we get an image out of it or not. So it isn't going to be the longest video. But I think I got a really good deal on this card. Yeah, it's an older car, but does a trick, right? Pop this down. Now so you get to see a video of installing a video card, upgrading your video card. So this is well at least a little bit off. Okay, there it goes. Yeah. So that does say EVGA if you can see it, but the pin layout is exactly the same. I already tested it. Every pin does what it's supposed to be doing. So we have two cables running to this card. Okay, yeah, everything kind of lines up perfect. That's weird. Yeah, everything kind of lines up perfect. Not really, but you know, you just uh, plug in the display. 
display cool cable and what's nice is this actually has a type c plug on it which is pretty nice so there's that all good hit the power switch for the power supply you can see the motherboards lighting up can you see that yeah barely so i'm gonna turn this the monitor the monitor's on so now I'm going to hit the power button. Okay, system's powering up. So we got the fan, got all that. Okay, we're getting an image. So yeah, the system seems to work. Okay, I think a little bit longer to boot than I would like. Is this stuck? Okay, never mind. Probably like, hey, you, you changed some stuff. Okay, and we're getting an image. Okay, that's cool. So the driver just like, hey, okay, now, now you see right here, it's lighting up blue. Okay, yeah, that seems to work. I guess, uh, it's right. Can you engine in heaven in real quick? Won't run the whole benchmark because this video isn't going to be super long. Let's see if we're going to get any kind of strange artifacting or nothing. So you just give this about 30 seconds and see what it does. Uh, I think it's on low settings. Was it low settings? Quality low. Yeah, we're on low settings because I was testing onboard graphics so I set it to low but we're getting like look at that 350 FPS 380 no artifacting so I'm gonna call it good with that you see the cards working and it already had the newest drivers on there Windows didn't really do anything if you know it did the little flashy thing real quick but I was like real quick it did that and it was ready to go it says we're using 150 100, almost a Almost 160 watts for the v for the video cards pulling that much. At least on here's probably pulling more than that. My CPU is only pulling 40 watts, but it's 40% usage, and the video card's really not doing anything because it's percentage-wise only seen 60 because it's low settings. But it's pulling you know 178 watts. There's a 182, so we're gonna call it at that on this video. So. Uh, what do you think you know did i get a good deal on this card i paid i think 190 192 dollars in total and it came from ebay you know it wasn't supposed to be here the monday and it came yesterday and now i'm finally testing it because i finally just like oh my cases are coming i'd rather have the system in the case before i try this video card said i have it floating there this is heavier and i want to take a chance on you know the slot getting damaged so i just went ahead and put in this case for and then i can put the side pan on you can see here this is almost just enough room it's still you know got a half inch and uh, a quarter inch or so from touching so no other case i could have would have fixed so you can see here again no artifacting no weirdness no smells nothing you know, cars running. What's the temperature? 55C. It's been running for you know over a minute and about a minute and a half or so. But I'm gonna call it at that. You know, what do you think? Did I get a good deal on uh, RTX 2080? You know, I wanted to go with the 3060 Ti, but that was a good. I couldn't pass a deal up like that. And one other side note, I did order some. I ordered two cards from china which ain't going to be here for two months for some reason hopefully i get them earlier they're gtx uh 1650 supra so they're four gig cards and i do have two more two more systems that will be good for them coming from shopgoodwill.com so i'll get them two computers first hopefully i get them next friday and then i'll have to set them for two months i might sell them unless you know, if I get other video cards to put in there, I'll sell them off. But yeah, that's going to be the end. Thank you for watching.